safeties and technology on how their steering components are, are mounted and what size they all are. NASCAR is looking at every one of those, those pieces with wide open eyes to see if it's something they like or don't like. Jamie? Casgarala competing full-time in the Xfinity Series this year. You do have truck experience, though. This is your third Las Vegas Motor Speedway behind the wheel of a truck. What do you hope to gain from these experiences? Well, some fun. Uh, I'm glad Tricon Garage is having me out driving this number one Tundra TRD Pro this weekend. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, but laps for the Xfinity race, too. Any, um, any experience is a good experience. So hopefully we got a fast truck tonight. Can go have some fun, put in a good run, and um, get the, the rutabush.com Toyota up front. His best finish so far has been fifth, fifth. We'll see if he can improve on that tonight. Yeah, and Kaz Grala, when I see him in this truck series, it reminds me of that first win he got at Daytona back mm -hmm. in 2017. And he's been one of those guys just begging and clawing, just trying to find an opportunity racing for this team and that team, even in Cup a little bit for RCR. But this year he's landed a full-time ride with Sam Hunt Racing in the Xfinity Series. So really excited to see what he can do with that solid ride every week. Yeah, and that team is on the move too. Sam Hunt really started just, just about three years ago, and he's continually built that team, has a great relationship with Joe Gibbs Racing. They get a lot of their equipment from there so uh it's an outstanding team and i think Kaz will do great things you can just look at this truck and know he's fast yeah the Haley deegan put down an awesome lap yeah, at 30 sure. 57 while we were talking to kaz there in that beautiful pinzoil truck of hers but this was just another league 32-2 for kyle